Hi folks, Steve Parkins here. Uh, we're in northern Thailand, uh, about 30 kilometers west of Chiang Mai. We're at an elevation of about just over a thousand meters, and, uh, close to 4,000 feet above sea level. And what we're looking at here today is coffee trees. Uh, they're grown here by the hill tribe people in the forests, and the beans on these trees are the Arabica bean. This is a very small percentage of coffee production in Thailand, less than 1%, and it's grown exclusively by the hill tribe people. And the beans, if you can see them here, are a green color. This is the coffee fruit. The bean is on the inside. And it's early September, and the harvest will be around the middle of November, so we're about nine, ten weeks out from when they start harvesting this. We'll know when the beans are ready because they will turn a burgundy or a dark red color and then they will be picked and they will be dried. The fruit will be pulled off the outside and then the beans will be uh, roasted. Coffee fruit dried in the sun for dry method processing. Too much rain can produce moldy fruit and beans. A temporary roof is placed over the drying racks. After soaking, the beans are spread out in the sun to dry to about 12% moisture before being sent to CMU for roasting. This coffee shop serves Arabica coffee that is organically grown right here it's a great place to visit. 